Good morning, guys, and happy 4th of July. <clears throat> if you're in the U.S., it's Independence Day. If you're not in the U.S., I hope it's a great 4th of July for you as well. Um, apologies for the lack of vlog yesterday. We it ended up being kind of an emotional day because we were at the shelter, and I found a dog I really liked, but basically the adoption fell through because of weight restrictions at the apartment complex. Um, and it kind of just sent me into a spiral all day, so I don't have a dog yet, but... Um, we're gonna move on past that. We're gonna go back to the shelter on Wednesday and get there a little bit earlier because it was a madhouse. It was just like super crowded there yesterday. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna do that Wednesday and uh, I'm sure I will find a dog at some point. But today is a little bit of an intimidating day, but an exciting one. Um, I woke up early-ish, it's 9.30, which I usually don't wake up this early. And um, I am gonna do my treatment and drink some coffee. And I'm gonna be placing the text call on myself for the first time and hang on, I'm running out of space. Never remember to delete videos until my camera starts flashing red. Um, but yeah, so I finally got, if you saw my vlog a couple days ago, I finally got insurance approval, which is wonderful because I. My last sensor expired on Thursday afternoon. It's now Mon or Sunday. I keep thinking it's Monday. It's now Sunday and I've been not catching hypos until they go quite low because I my body doesn't alert me like it used to. Um, <clears throat> and I'm sure I've been missing hypos at night because I'm not waking myself up for it. Um, which scares me in a way because... Like couple like two days before I left to come back to Florida um my sugar dropped into the 30s at night and I don't want to be missing that so um yeah so that is the wonderful news that it is approved and at least you know so in the meantime while I'm waiting for a first shipment to arrive because they're getting all that figured out and prescription sent and all that my endo clinic sent me another sample so I'll have at least one for 10 days and hopefully by then the shipment will arrive um so it'll be very nice to have that again and not be always like second guessing and um, having to use so many expensive test strips, but it's my first time placing it on myself. So it's a little intimidating, but we will do it. Um, <clears throat> when I first started doing the finger pokes, it was really intimidating and scary at first and now it's second nature. So this will be second nature at some point too. But I'm going to drink some coffee, do my treatment first, because it's a lot more comfortable to do the best without the sensor there, so I'm going to do that first. And then we're just going to do it and get it over with, so I'm not hanging over my head all day, and I can also keep it around on my sugar. So, that's what I'm going to do, and I'll see you guys then, after my treatment. Hey guys, so I finished my treatment, and thankfully, breathing a lot better. I was, like, having trouble breathing this morning, so very thankful for that. Um, I am turned patriotic. I've got my red, white, and chill from last year, and these pants I bought, so. I am, am red, blue, and blue sock and red sock. Didn't plan that one, but I am patriotic <laughs> for the 4th of July. So, like I said, I would just prefer to get this over with, so I'm not thinking about it all day, so that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I can't decide if I wanna sit or stand. I'm not sure, but um, first thing I need to do is reopen the app and reconnect Bluetooth because Usually I keep Bluetooth off, um, I just always have, but I need Bluetooth for this. And I also close the app because the person that closes my apps periodically, I can't do that when it's running, so I just closed it. Um, <clears throat> so I need to do that. And they sent me, um, sent me a new transmitter, but I don't, I'm not going to use that because I still have the other transmitter that should be good for another like 70 days. So, um, I'm gonna use that one. I've just been keeping it in a plastic bag and uh, I'm sit on the bed to do this. So, let's do it. And uh, then I'm gonna eat something because I need to take your couch up. <laughs> I woke up, I woke up early because of the breathing problems, I think, and my sugar was low. Now, the reason this needs to be done because I, I, was, I was just getting all the stuff together for my treatment and I started feeling really shaky and I was checking my sugar and it was low, so. I'd like to avoid all that. This makes me just a little bit nervous. It'll be fine. Um, follow what it says on the wall. I found the other um, 
transmitter. I've been, I, it, this expired on, the last sensor expired on Thursday. Um, and so I just cleaned the transmitter off and put it in here and I'll re-clean it again. Um, well, I thought I grabbed two alcohol wipes. I, I could have sworn I had two. Well, here's one. Where's the other one? Okay, well, I'll have to grab one of those. And got the app reloaded. I could have sworn I had to. Am I sitting on it? Okay. Um, and we'll do it. So, I'm not going to be able to tell me actually doing it because I'm not going to attempt this one handed. So, yeah. But, <laughs> um,. That makes me angry because I have to get back up. I could have sworn I had two of these. Okay. Well, I'm gonna do this. Start new sensor. And I also want to do it now because it's 11 o'clock almost and it takes two hours to warm up. So I'm already not gonna catch the morning trichafta stuff, which usually is a boost, which usually does like all this to me. So yeah. All right, I'll see you on the flip side. Okay, it was a success. I put it close to where the first one was. Um, yeah, I didn't, it's a little bit over, like closer to my belly button because um, there's more fat there, but I didn't bleed, which was I was worried about. Um, Cause the first sensor I had didn't bleed. The second one bled quite a bit, the, this one didn't. So apparently the left side of my stomach is better than the right side of my stomach. Um, I didn't really actually even feel it very much but I was shaking while I was doing it, but I just didn't even let myself think about it. I just kind of like automatically did it and just pressed the button and didn't let myself think. And it's done. And now I have to wait for the, um, the sensor warm up. But I'm going to uh, head out to CVS quickly because I need more juice because I've already drank a whole pack. Um, so I'm gonna get some of that. And I'm gonna take the dog out. Um, my brother's dog, I guess I don't have a dog yet. Um, and, uh, wait for this to finish doing that. So, and take your capta. But, uh, probably gonna upload this pretty soon, um, just so I can kind of relax for the rest of the day. And, um, this was the main event of today's vlog. Um, and I think I won't be so scared to do it next time. <laughs> um, and it's nice to have it back. You know, whenever you do something medical on yourself for the first time, you're kind of scared you're gonna mess it up. And, I mean, this... It's pretty idiot proof, but it's possible. So um, I also placed it closer to my um, to my belly button because I tend to lay on my side a lot. And if I, um, like last time when I had the other sensor, when I was laying on my side, it would kind of compress it a little bit. So um, on this side, the other one was closer as well. It was like closer up and I kind of like that placement better because um, I would keep compressing it and it would keep giving me false lows. So. Um, yeah, we'll just see how this works, but it's done. That's what matters, and um, now I can get better control over my blood sugar. And I'm actually feeling a little bit shaky, and I'm not sure if that's blood sugar related or just nerves. But um, I should probably check that. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and end today's vlog here. So happy 4th of July, everybody. Um, like I said, if you're in the U.S., it's Independence Day. If you are not in the U.S., I hope you have a wonderful 4th of July anyway. And um, not really sure what I'm going to get up to the rest of the day because usually there's hockey every other day, but there's not hockey till tomorrow. So we'll see what we get up to today. But with that, thank you guys so much for coming along on my morning with me, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night.